The BC Olatilo Show, known as the BOS, the flagship of all TV talk shows and events in Nigeria, has been and is still a delight to millions of viewers all over the world, not only because of its simple and unique style of presentation, but the family-oriented program has not failed in bringing Nigerians together through the coverage and projection of the various unique cultures and traditions in Nigeria. One of its latest coverages was the traditional wedding ceremony of the awesomely beautiful daughter of the late General Samuel Ogbemudia, a former military governor of the defunct Midwest region and two-time former governor of Old Bender State, and his wonderful wife, Mrs. Yetunde Ogbemudia. Sunday, the 26th of November, 2017, was the D-Day for the traditional wedding ceremony between Dr. Nosare Oluashion and her bow, Eken Odua Andi, who both hail from Edo State. As customary in Edo Kingdom, Nosare's bride prize was paid at her father's house at Victoria Garden City, Lagos, in the presence of her mother and kinsmen. Guests later moved to the convergence point for the reception, which was the Lagos premium event place of choice, the landmark event center. Uniru, Lagos. The very warm, social and highly connected mother of the bride, Mrs. Yetunde Ogbemudia, left no stone unturned in making sure the occasion was an A-class ceremony in all ramifications. She pampered her top-notch guest to the fullest. Entering the tastefully and highly decorated event center, one can tell that Mrs. Yetunde Ogbemudia is truly a woman of high class and taste. Dignitaries present were the Deputy Governor of Edo State, Right Honorable Comrade Philip Shaibu, who was the Chairman of the Day, the First Lady of Edo State, Mrs. Betty Obaseki, who represented her husband, the Governor of Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, the First Lady of Ogun State, Dr. Mrs. Olufun Shamosu, Philanthropist and Chairman Premier Loto, Sir Kessington Adebutu and wife, Chief Mrs. Koforola Adebutu, Ogun State Commissioner for Information, Chief Adedai Adene, Senator Daisy Danjuma, Billionaire Property Mogul, Sir Olu Okeowo, among many others. Others include a powerful delegation from Edo State, family, friends and well-wishers, among others. Starting the ceremony was the very glamorous entry of the elated mother of the bride, Mrs. Yetunde Ogbemudia who danced into the hall in company of her friends. Following immediately was the Ego Ones, led by the parents of the groom, Mr. Andy and Professor Rosemary Egoan. The Edo culture has made its print in the history of Nigerian wedding fashion, and as expected, the rich culture of the state was evident in the beautiful, elaborate attire of the typical Edo bride, as the beautiful bride, Dr. Nosare Egbemudia, decked very attracting fabrics with traditional coral beads to match. The grand entry of the couple was a very unique and colorful one. As they stepped into the hall, both dressed in their full Edo traditional regalia, in company of their friends, 
They danced like the prince and princess that they are, while the sugar band provided good danceable Edo songs. The opening prayer which was next on the agenda was said by Mrs. Daly George, the bride's elder sister, followed by the chairman's remark. The Deputy Governor of Edo State, Right Honorable Philip Shaibu, in his remark, thanked all who came out to celebrate love at its fullest. Admonishing the couple, Honorable Philip Shaibu advised them to learn the tool of communication as it plays a vital role in sustaining a long happy marriage he implored them to avoid external interference and live together in peace and oneness. Honorable Shaibu prayed for them and wished them well in their marriage. Today we are celebrating Musa okay? And for some of us that are already married and to continually thank God for making us man and woman, and for you that we are celebrating today, don't forget the tips of this wedding. Keep them very safe. You will need them as you move on this journey of marriage. Because you need to always renew that vow. For me, I would like you to know that as you are now husband and wife, you must always communicate. For your wedding and for your marriage to be successful, communication is key. And you must know today that you and your wife are one. You have detached from your parents, both of you. Now, from today, I have detached from your parents. You can only take advice and dissect them and screen them and use them. To lighten up the ceremony was comedy and cultural performances by MC Edu Pikin and the Ihonowe Theatre Troupe of Benin City, Nigeria, who took turns to entertain guests. <laughs> The couple, who had a 
change of attire proceeded for the cutting of their wedding cake, which was supervised by MC Edo Pekin. A photo and video session ensued afterwards. The dance floor, which was later opened by the newlywed, saw the sugar band, who never fails to deliver, rolling out quality music, which got all dancing. <laughs> In fact, my joy is full. I am the blessed of the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. I rejoice and I'm glad in it. My only regret is that my beloved husband is not here to celebrate with me. But I believe he's in heaven, smiling, looking at us, praying for us, for my daughter. Nosakari and my new son Ekan. In fact, I feel so fulfilled. I thank God because not many people have this opportunity. I am indeed fulfilled. So they should just be themselves. They should do things together. They should not keep any secret from each other to the best of their ability. They should enjoy their life. They should be caring to people both the young ones, the disabled, the disadvantaged children of the society. They should give back to the society what they got from the society. It's a very happy day for me. Extraordinarily happy, my dear. Happy because my son has listened to me. But I told him he comes from Benin and he should find his roots back to Benin. Irrespective of the fact that I sent him abroad about 20 years ago to go and study. Now he's come back, he has come to marry somebody from Benin. Particularly happy because I married my wife from the highest traditional institution, from the upper of Benin's palace. And now my son has taken a wife from the highest civil institution in Edo State. Brigadier Wemodia, who was the former governor of industry. I thank God for his blessing. From Biscon Communications, it's hearty congratulations to the newlywed, Dr. Nosare Uluwa and her love, Ekan Odua Andi Egonwan.